on the area and perimeter of the rectangle. Pause the video, try this out, and then we'll go over it. Okay, so all you have to do to find the area is to do the length times the width. So we're just gonna multiply 12 times 32, or 32 times 12, however you wanna do it, it's gonna give you the same answer. So when I do that, I get 384. Now it's time to move on to the perimeter. So basically what you have to recognize here is that they're not gonna write it in for you, but uh, for a rectangle, right, the opposite sides are gonna be equal. If this side right here is 12, that means that the opposite side, which is the other part of the rectangle is also 12 and vice versa for 32. So if this side of the rectangle is 32, the other side is also going to be 32. And there's two ways to think about this. You can either think about it, you could do 12 times 2 plus 32 times 2. That's one way to think about it. Or you could also just think about it like adding all of the sides up. And so that's the way I'm going to show right here. Okay, so again, all I'm doing here is I'm just taking all the sides. So I'm going to do 12, then I've got 32, then another 12, then another 32. So I just went around add them all up and that equals 88. So let me show you the solution. And so on the solution here, you'll note that I've shown the method here where you do two times 12 plus 32 times two. It's gonna give you the same answer for the perimeter. So whichever one's easier for you, that's what you wanna stick with. 